Hello traders, welcome back to the channel. Today, we're diving into something super exciting. Creating your very own trend indicator in TradingView. Whether you're new to coding or an experienced PineScript developer, this video will guide you step-by-step -step on how to build a powerful trend indicator. And the source code is in the description. Let's get started. First, let's quickly go over what trend indicators are. These tools help traders identify the direction and strength of a trend, which is crucial for making informed trading decisions. Some popular trend indicators include moving averages, MACD, and RSI. But today, we're going to create our own custom trend indicator using PineScript, TradingView's scripting language. To get started, open TradingView and navigate to the Pine Editor at the bottom of the screen. This is where we'll write our PineScript code. We'll begin by writing a simple script that calculates a moving average, which will be the foundation of our trend indicator. Let's start coding. Follow along with me. First, we set the version of PineScript we're using with slash add version equals five. Then we use the indicator function to name our script custom trend indicator and set it to overlay on the main chart with overlay equals true. The input.int function creates an input field in the settings of our script for the length of the moving average with a default value of 14. This means we can adjust the length of our moving average directly from the script's settings. Next, we calculate and plot the moving average. Here, ta.small close length calculates the simple moving average SMA of the closing prices over the specified length. The plot function then draws this moving average on the chart with the title moving average and colored blue. Now we have a basic moving average plotted on our chart. Let's add some logic to identify the trend. To identify the trend, we'll compare the current price to the moving average and use background colors to highlight bullish and bearish trends. We define two conditions. Bullish is true when the closing price is above the moving average, and bearish is true when the closing price is below. The BG color function changes the background color of the chart based on these conditions, green for bullish and red for bearish. With this logic, the chart background will visually indicate the current trend, making it easier to spot bullish and bearish periods. Let's enhance our indicator by adding a signal line that smooths out the moving average for clearer trend signals. We add another input for the signal line length with a default value of nine. Then we calculate the signal line as a moving average of our original moving average using tad.sma ma signal length. Finally, we plot the signal line on the chart, colored orange. The signal line helps to smooth out the moving average further providing clearer trend signals. You can adjust its length from the settings to fit your trading style. Now, let's apply our custom trend indicator to a chart and see how it performs. Feel free to tweak the parameters, like the length of the moving average and signal line to fit your trading strategy. Experiment and see what works best for you. And there you have it, your very own custom trend indicator in TradingView. This is just the beginning. There's so much more you can do with PineScript to refine your trading strategies. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and hit the bell icon to get notified of our latest videos. Happy trading, and see you in the next video.